Why would Hogan get involved in a match right before his match? Because <laughs> he's a fucking idiot, I guess. <laughs> Is that what they're trying to get him over as? The dumbass face? <laughs> he's just some idiot who gets involved in a match shortly before his match. Oh! Oh, and now I got a oh, fucking... I, so wait. Oh, God! Wait, do we just have to start from there? <laughs> God, that's a shitty way to start. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, hey, welcome to Rope Break, I guess. Hey, everybody. Coldest Smart open Mark ever. News here. I'm Dylan Smiley. Um, uh, we're hey. bringing you a weird as fuck, but exciting as ever, brand new episode of Rope Break. This time we're going back... To Uncensored 2000. All the way back. Boy, has it been an evening. Let's sit you down for a spell and tell you a story about our experience with Uncensored 2000. Dude, this has been like... <laughs> I felt like we've just been doing like a, an hour-long rope oh, break God. when we're not recording anything. Because we have we watched, like, about half we the matches on this card. We watched half the show. And <laughs> we didn't even see the Harlem Heat 2000 oh. with Stevie Ray and Fat Ahmed Johnson. Like what's Big this? T! Yeah, Big T. <laughs> it it should have just been Fat T. It should have just been Fat. <laughs> just Fa T. <laughs> just, just fat shit. But no business being in a wrestling ring. He wasn't like he was a fat guy that could move like Vader or Rikishi. <laughs> oh, speaking of Fat too. <laughs> hey. yeah. So we got started because the opening match was fucking Prince Ikea and Psychosis. And we thought it would be good. We thought wrong. Oh god, it was boy, terrible. Oh boy, it was awful. With uh with what was her name? Paisley, now known as uh, Queen Charmel. Ah, uh, yes. Charmel. Yeah, she was out there with uh the prince. Yes. Uh you know, the, prince the artist. All that's what the right. lower third said. The artist. Yeah. And that match was shit. It and, was really uh, bad. Then, God, what the fuck else did we sit through? The Brian Hobbs versus Three Count Handicap Hardcore oh, match. Oh, Jesus Christ. Titans. That shit was terrible. Oh. That, alone, that probably should have been a rope break episode, honestly. Proof. Because that match was terrible. Proof that if you're good friends with Hogan, the sky's the limit. Yeah, he they put the belt on that fucking idiot. You, you can dress like a cross between Ecstasy Dad <laughs> and Bubba Ray Dudley circa 2015. You're you're gonna have to pop up a picture of uh, of, of ecstasy dad like right, uh, I wish right I could here. splice. I wish I could morph the two do together. A little, do a little side by side action. Like like the middle thing in animorphs where it's like oh, half God. animal. <laughs> it's it looks gross. horrifying. Exactly that that's Brian Nobbs somehow went over three twenty year old kids at the height of their like peak physical condition. Yeah, and I don't out. know. Ugh. Ugh. The booking was just goodness garbage. So, this event has an attendance of 5,000 people in 2000, March of 2000. About a week or two prior, WWE at No Way Out brought in almost 13,000 people. You're looking at this audience, right? You got the floor seating. Then you got that one tier that's up. That row of seats is fucking empty. Mm-hmm. For... Uncensored, which is which has gone on for like five years now. Yeah, and Flair Hogan is the main event. Flair and Hogan, which is by the way what we're actually watching for this episode. Oh yeah, the Yappa Pie Strap Match. Yappa Pie Strap Match. Which, by the way, we had no idea was this recent. No, we thought I it mean, was like I thought it was like a nineties. It seems so gimmicky and so nineties yeah, fl- WCW. Flair and Hogan, that's ninety four. Yeah. Hogan in the red and yellow, that's ninety four. Hogan this big, though? Yeah. Like, this isn't post-steroid shit when he was in that weird Walt Disney parade signing the, Well, we need your John Henry! I'm gonna have you with uh, your John Henry. Oh, Henry. (laughs) Mark Henry chocolate bar. Oh, I thought you were saying that Hogan sold his... His his hair. What little (laughs) hair he had to buy a chain. For Ric Flair's pocket watch. Aww. But Ric Flair sold it for hair combs. Oh, it's adorable! And they were good hair combs. They were tortoiseshell hair, hair combs. <laughs> they were, that was a good shit in the turn of the century gay couple that is Ric Flair. <laughs> and uh, wait, who wrote that story? Oh, Henry. Uh, but, uh, <laughs> this has everything. It's got a leather. <laughs> it's got everything it could possibly want. It's got a leather strap. It's got leathery old men. <laughs> Look at them. It's, <laughs> that, like a, it's, like a, a, it's like a two man furniture store in there. 
Men Ring. I wish Walter Matthau would have lived to have starred in Leathery Old Men 3. <laughs> but sadly, wasn't the case. So, as fate would have it, as we're trying to fast forward to this match, oh. uh, we, we don't want to skip ahead too far. We're watching it on the network. Uh, we just caught the tail end of... It's, um... Terry it's, Funk and... No, wait. No, it was Sid and Jeff Jarrett. Yeah, Sid and Jeff Jarrett. Yeah, and yeah. apparently Sid and Hogan have buried the hatchet from WrestleMania 8, and they're <laughs> now best buds, and Hogan came out to, you know, like a face, help his best pal cheat in <laughs> uh, in retaining his title against Double J. And, um, like you said, that this is Hogan's gimmick now, he's just the dumbass, oblivious face, mm-hmm. that he decided to come out and interfere in a, ma- in a match right before his own match. And I guess he's oh he's, he's it's already oh. getting as sexual as the promos promised. It's sexual, baby. Whoa! <laughs> Speaking of oh, Henry, does that sign oh, say? Oh, ring I, the bell! Someone signed said I'm going to WrestleMania. <laughs> Point to the sign, <laughs> asshole. It even had an arrow on it. Here we go. Got him. Second match of the night where two competitors are strapped together. Hey, That's wait a minute. Thing. This can't even start right now because he doesn't even have it around his wrist, you dirty cheater. Aw, uh, boo! Dirty's player in the game. Hey! Whoa, it's wild, crazy eyes, Jimmy Hart. God, no wonder you always wear sunglasses, you Ugh. fucking lunatic. Oh my god, he's flabby as fuck. He really Flair. is. He really is. Hogan's not in that bad of shape. Flair, on the other hand, holy shit. Yeah, he Here really, we go! He really just does look like a man raisin. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> oh. He's a free mason. Oh, Jesus Christ. Free mason. <laughs> now he's not hooked up to the strap, or is he? It's that kind of episode. Oh! Oh, uh, God. When Flair leans against the fucking ropes and his skin is just like, oh, it just God, sticks it's gross. To it. <laughs> Who's next? Where is Goldberg? He wasn't even on this card. Is he injured? Yeah. Oh, shit. Uh. Uh. <laughs> oh! oh! There he goes. Oh, Whoa, Jesus Christ. Here's where it gets no, bad. No, no, no. Whoa, no, please, okay. Mr. Hogan. <laughs> please, Hogan, don't hurt him. And uh, 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 Here come the Hulkster. Uh, point. You didn't point! Uh, close oh lines him with a belt. Wait. Yeah, that's not how this works. You can't get a pinfall. No. What happens... You gotta touch the stupid fucking corner. You gotta touch each four corner. Whoa! You you wanted this match, Hogan. You don't even remember the stipulation? You don't remember the rules? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Boot break from the face. You know, that, was, the al- face. that was almost what we called the show, by the way. What was boot break? Boot break. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> it was the working... T- oh, my God. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh! Is he gonna pull him into the post? No? No! Okay, that looks stupid. That was a missed opportunity. But okay. Oh, God, I see what you're talking about now. Yeah, uh, it's how so it's, gross. How it's just like almost like cascading over the ropes. <laughs> it's like he's just, his skin is just spilling onto it. Oh, and then we got color. When did that happen? Wait, who's... F- Flair's busted open, of course. Is he? When the yeah. fuck did that happen? I don't know. I don't know when it could have happened. Next WCW star. Thanks, tie-dye guy. Fuck off. God, I hate that piece of shit. <laughs> I hate fans with gimmicks. Right? I gotta wear my same fuck thing. I gotta stand up for every damn thing. My sign's gotta be up for 80% of the show. Yeah, because people are paying to see you. Ah, fuck. Not not the guys in the ring. If there was Twitter in 2000, Tata guy would have been, Look out for me at Uncensored 2000! Like you're part of the show. He's probably posted on some shitty message board. Oh, yeah. Oh, no! Deadly Driver? He didn't even sell the punches. <laughs> he just punched him in the dick and he didn't even oh, move. Oh, God, that looked like shit. Didn't even budge. Sit down, tie that guy. Puerto Rican guy. Though. Puerto Rican guy. Wrestle Radio guy. They all got gimmicks. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, no. Get him, get him mouth. Look at that guy in the front Stay row. <laughs> he was shaking his head and then he just pointed. Like, yeah, you show him. You show him You mouth. give it to him. Whoa, he's about to get some of Flair's blood all over him. Gross. Ew. Wait, was well, that a thumb to the eye? Yeah, eye rake. sure was. Going all the rakes, all the eyes. Wow, nice ECW hat. <laughs> and Bret Hart jacket, Jesus. <laughs> he's repping every, every promotion but, <laughs> but the one he's one. It's, it's the one. total package! As he just <laughs> limply taps him on the head and of the And there he goes. He's out. <laughs> he's fucking done. <laughs> Thanks for coming, Luger. Package. <laughs> 
Oh, fuck. Oh, shit, Jimmy Hart's oh. pissed. Look at him. He's gone. He's shaking his fist at him. <laughs> he, he didn't even stay out there. Right, he just, he just tapped, tapped Hogan on the head with a chair and then fucked, fucked off. off to the back. <laughs> great. Great having you, Lex. Always a pleasure. That Puerto Rican flag gets around, dude. It really does. Jesus. Man. That guy is... They handed him out at the door? <laughs> oh. oh! Wow. He really okay. sized him up. <laughs> he really, yeah, he really <laughs> measured him for that one. Mm. And now he's just leaving. <laughs> he just... <laughs> arrive, punch dick, leave. <laughs> well, wasn't that an Undertaker shirt for a minute? <laughs> I think it was. It's a dick punch fight. <laughs> Jimmy Hart! Making himself a factor! Get in there. Take it to a mouth. Oh, that well. Uh, right. <laughs> there you some, go. Punch him right in the south mouth. <laughs> Ralph mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Sit on it, Jimmy. <laughs> Thanks for coming. You oh, got wait. punched in the mush, and now you're just getting your fucking ass handed to you. you getting your shot. mouth handed to you. <laughs> what a mess. Uh, oh, okay. Stomps him in the calf. Oh my god, so many yellow seats. <laughs> Yeah, dude, Hulkamania is running wild. <laughs> it's running so wild that no one showed up. Yay! <laughs> They're he's, all he's, afraid. He's Here getting he this goes. shit closer one. to being done. And two! I like how he didn't put over any of the shit Jimmy Hart did. Nope. Didn't even phase him. <laughs> uh, stomp it. Oh, God. It's like fucking Brian Knobs earlier in the show when all that fucking shit happened to him. Those people were doing diving fucking moves off the top rope. And then he just off the top of a ladder... And then he just stood up and blew him all in the face with a fire extinguisher. And some guy in the audience is just dancing in a sea of empty chairs. <laughs> what do you gotta and, do? Uh, you have all that room to yourself. And look at this flare stomping a dirt hole in him, as in old as dirt. <laughs> Wait, is he oh, is like, he choking him out? He's wrapping it around. Oh my his, god! Around his bald little head. Oh fuck! Somebody, put. Wait, he's got what? a. What is he that? He needs more. Like, for fuck's sake, dude, you've I, got him beat! I never understood how that was supposed to be, like, brass knuckles or something. Well, wait, wait, you get a taped fist? Like, I don't know what that yeah, was. Yeah, I don't... Oh, it was like a... Uh, what was it? A, uh, a roll of quarters? Wait. That's what? not how it works! Wait, what? Why are they pinning now? And now the big kick out. Look at the crowd not give a shit. Oh, now Flair's going... Whoa! Whoa, camera bump. Oh, oh shit. It's, it's the total the package! Total package. <laughs> oh, man. He, now he decides to come back. Oh, big boot! Wait. You stop doing that! What? What? No! What was the point of touching the post? That... Oh, fuck you! Wait, you had to do... Oh, okay, you had to do both. Oh, you that's to... bull. You had to get a pinfall and touch four posts. That's yeah, bullshit. Yeah, you, you were very right to throw garbage into the <laughs> ring. There's enough in there already, oh, but why not add some more? Jesus. Oof. This was painful. And Flair's just leaving. He just took the strap off <laughs> he's and he's like, gone. fuck this. I hate working here so much. Voice is shot yeah, from that. That'll do it. From laughing too goddamn hard at fucking Hogan. He always delivers, man. <laughs> he gave us a show, all right? He gave us a spectacle. <laughs> he gave us something. <laughs> he gave us something to go, to grow on. For rope break. <laughs>